All right. Just backing up just a little bit, Vanessa, can you kind of tell us what are all the different, if I'm a person who's never used a bank before, mm -hmm. and this is my first time coming in, what would you suggest to me or guide me through from savings to whatever else I needed to right. do so that I can fully utilize what Wachovia offers. Sure. Well, we're very, very fortunate that now we're working with Wells Fargo. So that even added even more uh, products that we didn't offer before. Uh, what I would typically recommend is a checking account for everyday use and that you could use, it comes with your debit card and you use it everywhere to you know, purchase as well as paying rent or everything else. So you could use it for groceries and everything else. Um, a savings account to put some money aside every month, you know, definitely pay yourself. I know we're gonna have another show about that. We'll get a little deeper into that. Um, I would recommend a way to save. We're, we're actually, uh, Wachovia Wells Fargo is one of the only, or the only bank that's offering that account. It's a great account, and it's an automatic transfer of savings. So every time you use your debit card, it automatically saves for you. You don't even have to worry about it. The money starts accumulating. It's earning a 5% interest, which is excellent. And you're also getting a 5% bonus at the end of the year. On top of that, we offer credit cards, of course, and then definitely it's very important to have uh, to have your credit build so that eventually you could purchase a home, which is another thing that we offer. Uh, we also offer investments for the future, investments for today, as far as uh, retirement, as far as if you have money sitting just anywhere, we could definitely put it somewhere to work for you. Uh, we also offer identity theft protection. We, ha we have a monitoring uh, system that we'll, you sign up for and we'll let you know if there's been any changes on your credit report as well as you get to review your credit report. Um, we're also, I mean, insurance products. If you're a business owner, we offer products for businesses as well, lines of credit. If you need the cash flow, we also offer um, investments for businesses. We offer just pretty much anything you could think of. We've, we're there for you. And, and, and what Kobe is all about the customer. And we want to make sure that our customers are taken care of. And, and yes, it is a, a scary time, but we're here for you. We're here to listen to you and walk you through it and answer your questions. So definitely going back to the beginning of the, of the question, that's, that's really what we're here for. Uh, again, just to, just to, just to kind of pick up wherever she left off. Mm -hmm. we, if you were to come in to, to the bank, you know, we kind of ask, you know, ask you a thorough, thorough questions. We, we, we offered something called a, a free financial review. Pretty okay. much we um, ask you a series of questions to determine which account is the best one for you, the best fit for you. Again, to go back to some of the stuff that she just mentioned, um, we're trying to find ways where we could help you through investment, home, um, life insurance, car insurance. Now with, with Wells Fargo, we also offer all of these type of services. Now, coming into the bank is just not coming in just to open up a regular checking account. A lot of people come into the bank and you pose the question, you ask them questions like, why, why ask them all these questions for? I just, I'm just seeing to open up a checking account. Our goal today is to make sure that when you come into the bank is to gather information about you and see ways we could actually help you going from buying your first home refinancing your car, you're probably paying a 17 or 16 or 12 percent interest rate on your car note. And our job is to make sure we ask you questions about your financial situation to see ways we could actually help you with that. So again, coming into the bank is a place where your, com your information is kept com very confidential and that the information that you we gather from you will help us decide which product and services is best for you. Again, to go back to what she was saying, we offer services from checking accounts to savings to um, investment opportunities to buying a car or you name it, we have it here at the bank. So your bank is pretty much your starting point going um, to help you succeed financially, not just today, but tomorrow and, and so forth and build that relationship up, uh, a relationship and mm -hmm. you could refer your friends and family to, to come in and continue banking with, with what right. Wacko. Thank you so much, Jamal. We're going to head to a break now, but when we come back, we're going to talk about something that um, Vanessa already mentioned, which was um, interest. We're going to talk about direct deposit. And for those people who are a little bit more tech savvy, we're going to talk about using your computer to handle your um, finances. So moving on from just coming to the bank, but also utilizing your computer as well as even your cell phone. So come back with us. Thank you. Fiscally Fit was brought to you by Wycovia Bank, a Wells Fargo company. 
El Dorado Furniture, and Scholars Today, Leaders of Tomorrow. Good day and welcome back to Fiscally Fit. I am your host, Sasha Wheeler. And today we're talking about mindset reset and we're gonna get back to our three experts here. Um, Fred, can you kind of talk to us about um, interests and um, so that our, our viewing public can know a little bit more about what that means and how that benefits them in the bank. Okay, interest is what the bank considered to be a profit to the customer meaning that you deposit or you hold a certain amount of funds with the actual uh, bank and they give you interest in return. And, and, to, and, and we consider that to be a profit for you. So in other words, it's as if you invested into the bank a certain a portion of your finances here and in return, for the bank say thank you, they go ahead and give you a portion, um, a, a percentage or interest rate that we consider it to be um, back to the customer. And that is usually compounded on a monthly basis. And um, every single month, based on the deposit you keep, the bank will give you a percentage of the actual deposit. And that's how interest um, is usually given out to our customers. Now, there are instruments where you can kind of go back into those instruments, instruments and say you want to get money out of them, you can. And then there's instruments where you put that in there, exactly. like CDs or something, exactly. and you can't touch them, right? A, a good example would be, of course, our CD, which is a, a product where you can actually keep a deposit for a certain time frame. And once the time frame has ended, or we call it maturity date, at that time you can withdraw the funds and decide to either continue or roll over your actual CD, or you can either take the funds and use another product to gain more interest. And a second, another product we consider to be our savings account, of course, is a good product where it's a liquid asset to you. At any time um, of the day of, uh, during our banking hours, you, are, you have access to those funds. So that's our savings accounts. And of course, like we said um, initially before, our high performance money market accounts are another form of savings accounts, which are not locked in for a certain period of time. They are there for you at your, at your leisure. So anytime you need to access those funds, they are there for you at any time of the day. Okay. Then. Now, we were talking about access to it, but now when people get paid, sometimes they got to go to the bank and deposit it, or if they don't have an account, and hopefully by now they'd be persuaded into getting an account mm -hmm. that's going, give their fingerprint and all exactly. that thing. But something that'll make it easier for them is direct deposit. How is that set up with Wachovia, and what are some of, um, what are some of the advantages of getting a direct deposit account? Well, direct deposit is a very, um, flexible um, way of you receiving funds from either your place of employment or other fashions. So um, most, most likely the, the most um, uh, well-known way is through your employer. What it does is instead of you having to receive a check from your employer and then going to the bank and waiting in long lines to cash the checks, you can have it sent straight to your account in the form of something called an ACH. And that's something that uh, your, your employer used to send the money um, into your account more quicker. So instead of you having to wait a few days to either for that um, check to actually clear, you can, you can actually have that, that check sent directly to your account and it's available the actual date that they decide to send it. So that's something very convenient for our customers. Right. So um, that's something that we, we, we try to push as much as possible because um, honestly, you wouldn't want to be staying, standing in long lines, wasting your time where you could be uh, doing something else that can benefit you and your family. Okay, man. And um, when that money is directly deposited into their account, is there any way for them to automatically divvy it up, Vanessa, or is it all going to go one place first? Or Definitely. Well, we could, uh, <coughs> going back to what Fred was saying, it's just the, the, just the, the convenience of knowing that at midnight, as you're falling asleep, that <laughs> money is going to be in there. So you wake up in the morning, the money is there. No lines, no ever, anything else. Uh, we could set it up to where, like for example, we talked about the way to save and we talked about a savings account or the money market. We could actually set it up so that on that same day that, that your direct deposit comes in, uh, whatever amount gets sent into either the savings account or the checking account. So it goes directly into the checking and then from there you could split it up into the savings or however you, wanna, however you want to divvy it up. It's up to you, the customer. 